As good as a series is, in almost every series, there is at least one episode that completely falls off the grid and just doesn't pull you along. But today, we show you series episodes that were not only extremely boring, we show you seven fierce series episodes that went way too far and triggered fierce debates among the audience. Included are TV episodes that caused a storm of indignation among viewers and series episodes that were so extreme that they disappeared from TV forever. Which episode was even responsible for mass hospitalizations we will also reveal to you. It's going to be very exciting, so stay tuned here at Wonderland. Oh, and feel free to write us in the comments which series you really celebrated most recently. We are curious. Number 7. We're talking about Breaking Bad. The series about the chemistry teacher Walter White and his former student Jesse Pinkman, who produce mind-expanding substances together, has given its fans many memorable scenes and episodes. But one episode caused a real storm of indignation among fans, and that is because it is said to have been extremely boring. This is episode 10 in the third season, which bears the name the Fly. In the episode in question, Walter and Jesse lock themselves in the lab to work overtime when they discover a fly. As a result, Walter makes many breakneck attempts to take down the insect, interrupted only by conversations between Walter and Jesse. However, there was a reason that the episode was produced in such a monotonous manner, as the team allegedly stretched the budget beyond measure with the previous episodes. In order to get back within the approved limits for the rest of the season, they had to produce a so-called bottle episode, an episode that takes place in a very small space, has hardly any actors, and is therefore inexpensive. This episode did just that, but fans chastised the production. With an IMDb rating of 7.6, The Fly is the lowest rated Breaking Bad episode on the user portal, and some critics even called the episode the low point of the series. Number 6. How I Met Your Mother was one of the world's most popular sitcoms for nine years. The comedy series was a real phenomenon and created a real hype among fans. That's why everyone was looking forward to the series finale. The expectations of the fans were high, and in the end, almost everyone was disappointed. <laughs> because with the last episode, the producers went much too far. The last episode not only shows the wedding between Barney Stinson and Robert Shabatsky, for which they had worked the entire ninth season, viewers also finally got to meet Ted's wife, Tracy. So until then, most fans should have been satisfied, but the last few minutes left fans stunned. The makers of the series fast forward to show that Tracy would die completely unexpectedly, and also the marriage between Barney and Robin would fall apart. This finally clears the way for a relationship between Ted and Robin. Shortly after the final episode aired, fans ran up a storm and vented their anger, especially on social media. The death of Tracy was particularly criticized, as it was too depressing for the series for many fans. Also, the failure of the marriage between Pickup Barney and the presenter Robin made fans angry, since the two were the real dream couple of the series. Even leading actress Alyssa Hannigan, who portrayed Lily Aldrin in the series, finally agreed with the fans, and said that she was very unhappy with the ending. Number 5. Let's move on to The Walking Dead, and a series that has been causing controversy time and again for over 10 years. And although there are always pretty violent scenes in the series, one episode in particular from the seventh season has burned itself into the memory of fans. No wonder that, according to critics, the episode is one of the most brutal TV moments of all time. No! Oh God! <laughs> 
This refers to the first episode of the seventh season, in which antagonist Negan, played by Jeffrey Dean Morgan, threw two main characters out of the series at once. Abraham and fan favorite Glenn lost their lives in the most violent way, and the episode, which showed the attack horrifically drawn out, went way too far for some fans. Not a few critics criticized the brutality of the episode, and not only they were shocked, also also, Abraham actor Michael Kudlitz told in a podcast that the series makers had overdone it with this episode, and the depiction of violence was extremely offensive. Number 4. Pokemon has been extremely popular since the late 1990s, but not everything was always so rosy with the TV series of the same name. There are numerous episodes of the cult series that went way too far for many critics, and were banned after their initial broadcast. One of them is the episode Beauty and the Beach, which is now only broadcast in a censored version. The reason for the outrage is a beauty contest in which 12-year-old Misty is supposed to participate. Her counterparts, Team Rocket villains James and Jesse, also take part in the contest, though in this episode, James has an oversized bust line, which he keeps showing off. Such female body shapes are not atypical for Japanese anime, however, James James keeps teasing 12-year-old Misty about her small bus size, and she even gets kicked out of the competition for this reason. Later, an older gentleman also declares that he looks forward to Misty getting a little older, so he can have some fun with her. These statements are clearly a step too far for a children's series, and caused outrage among fans and critics. In the meantime, the entire beauty pageant has been removed from the episode. By the way, the episode Electric Soldier Porygon was also never aired in the USA and Europe, and was also banned in Japan after its first broadcast. The reason? In the episode, there is an explosion with blue-red flickering lighting, and it was precisely these that triggered epileptic seizures in Japanese children. After the first broadcast, around 700 people had to be hospitalized because of this. Number 3. Let's continue with an episode of the extremely popular sitcom The Big Bang Theory, which clearly went too far, especially for the lead actor Jim Parsons, alias Sheldon Cooper. In the episode Paradoxical Psychology from the third season, Sheldon and Amy split up after an argument in the dining hall. Although Sheldon does not want to admit it, he falls into a deep hole and consoles himself with five cats that he takes in the apartment. It's just too bad that actor Jim Parsons suffers from a blatant allergy to cat hair. Although the producers of the show knew about the allergy, they wrote the cats into the script and didn't listen to the Sheldon actor's objections. In an interview, he explained that he had previously warned the writers that he would react violently to cat hair, but a week later, the script arrived in the mail, along with a package of an anti-allergy drug. Jim Parsons mastered the episode professionally, but he says that he hated the filming of this Big Bang Theory episode the most. Number 2. Continuing with The Simpsons, and an episode that first aired in the US in 2007 and in Germany in 2008. In the episode Homer Homer falls into an open grave during a funeral service. Not only does he sprain his back, but the fall gives him the ability to sing like an opera singer. He becomes a celebrated star, and the fans are at his feet. Up to this point, the episode is still harmless. However, when Homer is stalked by a rather persistent female fan, the episode takes a turn that, in the eyes of many critics, went way too far. Namely, her fan, Julia L. Dean is not only shown very revealing and extremely sexualized, her stalking and eventually even her physical assaults are ridiculed in the eyes of many critics. Assaults on men are played down in this episode, while real victims would suffer massively from such attacks. Studies also prove that more than a quarter of all men in adulthood have been sexually harassed at some point. This is a topic that remains 
it's taboo in the eyes of some people when it continues to be made fun of in TV programs. Number 1. Game of Thrones, of course. Because there are several episodes here that are still extremely controversial today, starting with The Red Wedding and ending with the brutal end of Oberyn Martell in the fight against Ser Gregor Clegane. Today, however, we're talking about the fifth episode of the eighth season, called The Bells. In the last episode before the grand finale, the great battle for the capital of King's Landing is at hand. After some fighting, it is finally clear that the city is falling, and all the Lannister troops surrender, completely demoralized. Although Daenerys Targaryen, who until then was the absolute favorite character for many fans, realizes that the battle for King's Landing is won, she systematically burns down the entire city with her dragon, Drogon. Not only the soldiers perish, but also the civilians population and many children lose their lives. While some viewers celebrated the surprising turn of events, many fans were shocked because, in their eyes, this sudden attack did not fit the Dragon Mother's personality at all. Many of them wanted to see her sitting on the throne at the end of the series, but within a few minutes, this hope was destroyed. Many fans were also absolutely dissatisfied with the demise of Jaime Lannister, because hardly any other character character experienced such a strong development as he did. The fact that he returned to his sister, Cersei, at the end, and gave away the opportunity to save the lives of thousands of innocent people disappointed many fans. It's no wonder that the last season as a whole was extremely slated. That's it for our video. Feel free to write us in the comments which series episode went too far for you, or if you can think of another shocking episode. Otherwise, like this video if you enjoyed it, and see you next time here at Wonderlane.